Montana Williams, direct, Director of State and Local Policy for the Chamber of, Pro Chamber of Progress. Yep. Good afternoon, Chair Murphy, Chair Crichton, and members of the committee. My name is Montana Williams, and I am the Director of State and Local Public Policy for the Chamber of Progress, a center-left tech industry coalition promoting technology's progressive future. Our corporate partners include companies like Uber, Lyft, Instacart, and DoorDash, but our partners do not have voting or veto power over our positions. We support H1234 and urge this committee to do the same. First, app-based drivers provide a valuable service to base taters. Every day, app-based app -based drivers deliver food to families, including those that live in food deserts, um, provide an accessible transportation option for people without nearby transit, and in the pandemic, help transport riders seeking immediate medical attention. Second, hundreds of thousands of Massachusetts residents rely on gig work as a significant source of income. In 2017, the Bureau of Labor Statistics reported that more than 200,000 Bay Staters relied on gig work as a source of income, a large portion of whom are people of color or immigrants. Today, women that have been disproportionately impacted by the pandemic due to an increasing need for childcare and job cuts in the home cleaning, hospitality, and service industries rely heavily on gig driving. Women now make up 58% of DoorDash and about 50% of Uber, Uber's delivery drivers. Third, numerous surveys have found that gig drivers want both flexibility and better benefits and wages. As a result, they prefer not to be classified as employees but want independent contracting to bring better wages and benefits. In short, they don't want to end gig work but wanna make it better. H2, H1234 would do just that giving drivers a new type of portable benefits that would travel with them while retaining driver independence and flexibility. The bill would mandate that ride share and delivery companies contribute to a driver's portable benefits account, providing drivers with new benefits such as income replacement, retirement plans, and minimum wage protection. And finally, H1234 would put Massachusetts at the cutting edge of experimentation for new mold, for new models, excuse me. By piloting a portable benefits approach, Massachusetts would become a trailblazer in creating a more inclusive, supportive, and fair gig labor force in the United States. This legislation echoes steps taken by the United Kingdom, where the government classified 70,000 drivers in the intermediate worker category, allowing those drivers to qualify for minimum wage, holiday pay, parental payments, and free insurance in case of emergencies. It also echoes federal legislation sponsored by leading Democrats, including including Senators Mark Warner, Michael Bennett, and Chris Coons that would create a national level of portable benefits. The changing nature of the workforce demands new approaches to both work and benefits. Rather than limiting gig work, which has proven to be a lifeline, lifeline of supplemental income for thousands, especially during the pandemic, policymakers should focus on improving it and providing a modern, flexible benefit structure. Proposals such as H1234 would provide a new type of support to app-based drivers that fits the, that fits the way thousands of people work today. Thank you.